Okay, this is a tough one. Urgot, like, I guess that makes the most sense. All of them are kind of bad. <laughs> Or got luck salty to execute them. You know what? That actually isn't a bad idea. I figured like I chain them and then I eat them and then like that they're like perfectly in in, in, in a spot for me here. We're playing some element spellbook today on the PBE. It's not out on live servers just yet. So there's gonna be some jank. There's gonna be some like it's broken, baby. And we're in a mirror matchup, which is gonna be a blast, dude. Can't wait. This video is sponsored by Dungeon Fighter 2. If you've ever heard of Dungeon Fighter Online, this is gonna excite you. Because the 17 year old RPG that is one of the biggest MMOs in the world is now here as a Smash style 2.5D fighting game. And by that I mean it's completely, absolutely fucking balls to the walls. With incredibly stylish, stylized graphics, dazzling skill effects, and complete screen takeovers, and the most important thing of all, fighting game fans, we've got rollback net code let's go it's available for purchase right now alongside all of the modes that fighting game fans should have an absolute blast with story mode practice mode survival mode arcade you can just queue up for ranked with an online simplified matchmaking system where you're just put in a queue and you get put against anybody as soon as you're able to play them thank god this developer is actually taking advice from fighting game fans and making rollback net code i cannot believe that there's games like to this day that release without it but it's on playstation 4 playstation 5 and it's on steam so Go check it out in the link in the description. The reviews are great on it, and if you're a fan of the Dungeon Fighter Online franchise, this might be the one for you, or if you're a fighting game fan in general. Now, onto the video. Alright, Chief, hold on. Alright, Chief. Alright, Chief, hold on. Ah! <laughs> he missed! Oh, wait, I'm level 2! We start level 3, I forgot, dude, what the hell? I wasn't playing with a full deck. It's not fair. It's not fair. It's not fair. It's not fair. Ah! Ugh! Ugh! What's he got? Fellow six. You gotta relax, man. No fucking mana, man! I mean, it was like the most obvious play of all time, but I did not look at my mana reserves at all at any point there. What else we got? We got Evelyn, Diana, we on Trindamir, Senna, we on Ezreal, Choga, I thought we on Soraka. Alright, that's maybe like a bit of a question mark, but like, you know what? Like, it is what it is, I suppose. Okay, not like the greatest salty I've ever whipped out in my entire life, but still, why are you pulling up on me, dude? What the hell is going on? What the hell is happening here? Why are we moving so fast as well? Or you get extra speed on this game mode or something? I don't know. He's like he's pulling up like Michael Schumacher. So am I. I'm I'm going really fast as well. Yeah, like it's uh, uh this game mode is uh, a bit chaos. I don't really know how I feel about it. I feel like it's just like a n a nightmare most of the time. If I had to shop anywhere, where would it be? Shoppsycle.com. I would, I would have to argue. If you're putting me on the spot, gun to my head, where would I shop? Shopsycle.com. Okay, you got no mana? I need to get six, man. If he makes a misplay here, I need one minion, man. Ooh! <laughs> that play actually kind of worked. Let's go. I don't even know like what you're trying to tell me here, man. All right. <laughs> you peace. You peace. I'm going to press the baton. <laughs> I pressed the button. It's been over. Well, has it been over two years? Well, it's like, ah, yeah, it has been over two years since this whole world event started. You know what I mean? The new like, the new, the new, the new, the new patch for like Earth of the 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 virus. Maisie uh, has finally caught it, but I haven't. And we've been in the same place, and it has been like I think it was at that market the other day. But I was also there. But I now now we are just like living on different sides of the house and I, I think it may be her immune system is like not as strong or I have a very chat immune system but I've been testing like every day and I'm fine 
Like, and I'm I'm just like v vaguely confused. One could argue. Rep Bozu. So like basically we just talked through closed doors now. She seems fine. She just seems like a little bit like she's got a cold. Her throat's a bit like, eh. but um, she like slept off yesterday. And she's like totally fine today. That doesn't mean that like other people are quite as lucky to have like not that much reaction to it. However, I mean I almost gagged on a was that a PC was that a PCR test? I don't know. Maisie is usually the one that does it for me because like you have to get kind of like the back of your tonsils for the test, and I'm not good at it, so I don't trust myself to do it. I had to do uh, one yesterday though, and I was like. <laughs> That's how I knew I was hitting the spot because I was going. Eah! I would not be the throat goat. Is all I'm saying. You can take what you you want from that particular sentence. I'm I'm quite a stubborn person though. Like I have not caught it because I I mean I barely go outside at the best of times. But wait, are you kidding me, man? Like it's been two years. You, you think I'm gonna catch it now? Are we like getting domed or something? Oh, we are. Why is there three top? What are y'all doing? I can put my thumb in your eyes. <laughs> Unsealed spellbook is a bit of a mixed bag because uh, every single time it's just an absolute complete stomp, and I never get to be the team that's stomping. <laughs> but like, you were, wait, really got trounced by somebody called Buttlicker Nine Thousand? Echo, okay. Cannon Barrage, hostile takeover. I think like realistically, it has to be Echo. I think like it, it, there's there's a there's a case to be made here that it's a must get. This seems slightly dirty. Echo always seems like very good on Belbeth. All right, let's try and get a dub. I have actually, I think I've played four or five games of Ultimate Spellbook since it came out on PB, and I have yet to win one. Worry about how you when you get to it, bro. You don't need to, you don't need to matter about that shit. Play the champion you're best at. Doesn't matter if it's fucking dog shit. If you're good at it, you're good at it. Too many people like fall into the trap of like, I have to play this because it's good in the meta currently. But like, um, who fucking cares, man? You're playing against some dipshit who's like meta calling you for no reason, but they don't actually understand why. The amount of times that I've played into a lane where like, I'm, I, I see a pick and I'm like, I guarantee this person picked this because it's like the number one counter on like u.gg or like lolcounters.com and I'm like, this person has no games on this character but they just randomly picked that character into this matchup and then they get absolutely domed because they just like, they don't actually know why it's a counter and instead are like, Ah, it must be an PM. it must be a free win! Who's your first main? Um, oh man, that's actually tough. I, 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 there, uh, uh, maybe Kassin? Maybe no, no. See, I've never, I've never really stuck to a main. Here's the thing, right? I, 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 even in all my time playing, I still, I very rarely ever actually stick to a champion. That like, it's, I, I do this. I just, I don't know what, I don't know why I've always been like this, but I have. Like, I just always like playing on the champions. I just can't help myself, truly. But I think like, if by like meaning we're talking like, you played that particular character like a considerable amount, then I think that's that's something that I can maybe potentially groove with. I went, my, Pantheon wasn't my first main. I, I obviously like did get into playing Pantheon, but even then, like we see main, I, it just means like something totally different. Like it doesn't. It, I what the? F I never ever at any point stopped playing the champions. I like just like playing. I got fright there. I didn't know what the hell was going on. Yeah, I, I know that it was Jana Ali, but I was like, why did that happen? <laughs> Forgot what game mode we were playing for a second there. But I mean, they, like, listen, they say variety is the spice of life, and I would be like vaguely inclined to agree in certain aspects of that. The most fun part about like when I started getting into MOBA games was like, ooh, what does this button do? I get I get absolutely demolished by a champion. I'm like, yo, what that champ do? Play them for a little bit, get demolished by somebody else? What that champ do? Now that's obviously much easier in games like Dolo, where like every champ is free from the offset. Not so much when you're spending like 10 bucks every single time you find a new champ and you like, uh, in League, where you have to purchase them, but still. There's I, I there's no shot that I'm behind, right? Like, I, I, I'm just gonna say this, I have to be ahead. I've already gotten like a kill, I've been farming, like there's no way that she's like ahead of me somehow, right? I'm gonna be mega, mega molding if that's actually the case. You know what, Belveth might be actually just AFK, but also she might not be. Her blue buff was up already, which would indicate to me that she's not in the game. If she'd actually took him, taken blue buff early, it would not be up, so like, I don't know, <laughs> it shouldn't have been up there. Are they, oh, the void coral, my bad. Bro, you know what I'm feeling, I'm honestly like, I'm, 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 I'm vibing with a dive currently, just because we can, so push up. Or alternatively, I just go. Yeah, 
You know what? That works. Don't even have to echo all week. That's pretty. Uh, mm -hmm. How is it that like the only win I get is like a a, a jungler that's not even there? <laughs> my first win against an AFK. Oh my god. Oh, that's actually like kind of tough, man. The Garen seems funny. <laughs> It, it do be kind of nasty, but it's also a little bit too team playery for me, and I don't like that one bit. I'm sorry. You're asking me to play for the team here. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know who you are. Set's fun, man. Like, listen. Um, this isn't to like put you down in any regard because it's exactly the same situation for me and for everybody else probably sitting in the chat right now. You're not going pro, man. So like, at the end of the day, it's a game. So many miles in the moving, the same way, and you know where it goes. She's been. Moving so fast, I've been taking it slow. Hey, change. It's the funniest thing like, because I'm not at the end of it. I'm not at the end. We, dude, we gotta, we gotta. <laughs> we both tried to mitigate damage there. <laughs> Don't worry about getting high rank because, like, have you seen Testo, man? Well, this isn't an insult to Testo by any stretch of the imagination, but, like, High evil players aren't happy. You know that? They're miserable, dude. I, like, see the amount of people that I follow on Twitter that happen to be, like, in the upper echelons of, like, the game, and they're just like, I hate everyone here, I hate myself, I hate the game, I don't know why, what I'm doing with my life. And it's, like, a real thing that is, like, just common amongst all of these players. Just, like, enjoy <laughs> the game. Like, doesn't matter how you do it, just try, just for God's sake, try and cause some goddamn enjoyment out of the thing you spend a lot of time doing. Yeah, like, you can you can definitely sweat it out um, for gold if you wish. Because at that point, like, there's there's actually, like, a tangible reward that you get. It's a, a neat little skin. Like, it's, it's worth going for it, man. It's, like, it's a cool skin. And, it, and you know, I, like, I'll, I'll sweat it to gold and then I'll be like, you know what, 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 what will be will be. But beyond that, you you really are playing the game for the sake of... You are, you're sweating ranked for the sake of sweating ranked at that point. Beyond that, right? Like, I was playing, um... I was playing, like, some ranked duo with Kev yesterday. Just because we were both, like, shilling. And, um... Camille Ollie. We actually could fight this. No ch no cap. What the fuck? I'm pressing E! Why can I... What the f Oh my god, I was silenced. Was I silenced? What the hell happened? We played a couple of games, and then, like, one of our games, we were winning pretty hard. Corky was doing really well, and then, like... This guy had 600 games in gold, and then Lilia took blue buff, and then he said, that's it, and then just like ran top, and then like did not leave the lane. And I was like, like, what What are you doing this for? I was like, what happened? I, I've not really been paying attention. He's like, she took blue buff, and I'm like, right, what's your point? And she's like, I don't care. I don't care about this game, and I'm like, that's like, obviously, that is like demonstrably untrue. You have 600 games this season. So like, I'm not trying to like call you out here, but like you definitely do care. I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna poo in a second. Why are you still going? Why are you still zooming, bro? Why are you still zooming? Why are you still zooming? What are you talking about? I'm gonna need a hand here, by the way, just in case that wasn't obvious. Yo, Twitch, by the way, that also means you. You fucking bozo. Help, does he? Does he? You're fucking some kind of guy, you know that? Bro, why? Just come on, I'll attack the damn thing. He got it, he got it, he got it, he got it, he got it. Tricky Dicky, thank you so much for the sub. Do you believe there's a NASCAR driver called Dick Trickle? Why do you name your kid that, man? Richard Trickle? You gotta know, right? You can't just be naming your kid Richard Willy Nilly. Like, you seriously can't be just naming your kid Richard Willy Nilly. That's cool. However. For fuck. Dude, why do I just do, like, absolute negative damage to, like, any of that team? I uh, Granted, I did miss my W, but still. The Skarner is bending me over the coals. Like, raking me over the coals, man. I don't think there's probably, like, 
that many kids named Richard these days, like, being born and named. They're probably being called, like, Khaleesi and or the Punisher. Maybe they got called, like, the Joker or something. I don't know. Why don't we do a little fighting? We do a little kill steal. Dude, I can kill steal like an absolute madman with this, huh? Like, you never want to, like, meet somebody and they unironically say, I'm the Joker, baby, and they're actually being serious. Like, that's their name. I'm so glad I got him. Like, I'm so glad I got him there. Like, I, like, I don't, the thing is, like, I guarantee there is, like, some Chinese kid out there called the Joker. When my, my friend Chris was teaching in China, um, they let kids, like, pick their, uh, English names. And then, like, he said he had, like, three Batmans in his, um, and I think, I think it's, like, a cool thing. And it, like, it definitely encourages, like, the kids to, to learn. Like what their you know what their what names are and what they, they mean etc. But also like I don't know man. Do you give a kid that like <laughs> that uh, that amount of responsibility? And it's a it's a tough one for sure, right? You got this. He's dead, right? Never mind. I don't know if like kids are jaded enough these days where they actually like somewhat agree with the Joker. I think that's like more maybe like a teenage boy thing. Like they. They get pants at school, then go home, and then start writing, like... They start, like, reading uh, The Killing Joke, and they're like, damn. Or, like, they watch, like, The Dark Knight, and they're like, he's burning money. He's like, man, society do be like that, though. I, I, I've said this, like, before, right? I, and, but, like, and this is no joke, no word of a lie, but, like, Maisie knows a baby. I don't I say knows a baby. Knows a, 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 a somebody, a parent who named a child Ezreal Snipes. And, and and the and the funniest thing is they don't play League of Legends and they don't understand what that like what the reference is, which is hilarious. <laughs> even even if you do, even if you don't play League of Legends, you have to un, you have to somehow like realize that's a ridiculous name, right? Like that, it's not like an illegal name, but like like Jesus, man, Ezreal Snipes, <laughs> like come on, man, you're yoking me, man. You're actually yoking me for no reason. You have no reason to yoke me right now. Like, bro, shut up, man. How the f What the hell is going on, man? I'm spamming buttons and nothing's happening. How do we lose all these things? What the hell? You're gonna name your kid Jaro Lightfeather. I beg you don't. But that being said, I don't think you're like. I don't think that you're, uh. I don't think that your second name sign is a Lightfeather. Those parents want their kids to get bullied, Keegan. I. You know what we should start doing? Instead of, like, kids getting bullied for dumb names that they have no control over. Why don't we start bullying parents? Why do we need to start encouraging that, right? No, and I'm not talking about parents, parent on parent here. I'm talking the kids start bullying the adults. And be like, you absolute dweeb. Why did you name your kid that, you moron? Maybe pants him, maybe give him a wet willy. I don't know. We have to, we have to come up with a system here. Fucking Christ almighty. I got double fucking holy! They're dead though. That works. A, th a thousand damage just from chain of corruption, not from like the the proc from like the passive. It would appear. <laughs> damage. Good point. I'll teach my daughter to do just that. Yeah, we have to be empathetic. And I'm not saying that like having an, an I, I like I like unique names, right? Don't get me wrong. I've got nothing against unique names, but like, if your if your second name is Trickle. Maybe you don't call your kid Dick, okay? <laughs> Too hard. <laughs> For f it's not that hard, man. I am. F I was glancing at chat, dude. I was glancing. I actually got caught glancing. Oh my god. I got caught glancing. <laughs> I actually just ran it down, but I was looking at chat because those people were talking. <laughs> There's an intro. Uh, we're having an interesting conversation here, and I'm. I was. I was too engrossed in it. I, that, that's my bad. I took my eyes off the road for like uh, half a second. I'm gonna name my kid Draven. Draven. I'm begging you, even as a joke, don't do that. How, I wonder how many kids like actually are being named after like League of Legends characters. I hope none. Is that is that is that allowed to be like? I hope nobody's naming their child this. There, you know what? There's some. There's some names in League of Legends. That I'm like, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Like even like, like endgame. I don't know if Nila is a um, 
a real life name. You know what? It's actually kind of a pretty name. Naming them like Velkos though, I'm gonna have to put my foot down and be like, you need to stop. So, uh, yeah, I like Samira as a name as well. I do like Samira as a name. Yeah, Annie. I know, like, obviously, like, Caitlyn, Annie, etc. Victor, yeah, yeah, yeah. Olaf as well is a real name. I'm talking, like, fantasy, actual fantasy names, though. Like, Trundle. <laughs> <laughs> nice try, Bozo. I got damage reduction. You sweaty little goober. Shut up. Bro, I wonder if somebody has named their kid Gandalf. Is that, like, an insane thought or, like, what? But like, yeah, I just really love, like, the Lord of the Rings. You see people naming their pets after, like, League Champions all the time. And that's, like, fine. Because, like, a cat doesn't know shame. Not, or not as we perceive it. Cho'Gath. Like, yeah, I'm talking stuff like that. But there's got to be, like, worse ones than Cho'Gath, right? Gragas. You know what? Like, not a bad contender, I would argue. I don't want to talk about that. Ergot, you know what? Ergot's probably a good one for like bad. Just name your kid Blitzcrank. Like, yeah, why not? Yeah, name your kid Darius, and then their middle name can be the Hand of Noxus. I'm fucking going through it, Chief. I'm gonna be honest with you. Whoa, matey! I'm just I can't, uh, no, what the? I tanked like so many always there, man. I ulted whilst getting Urgot dragged, but I was in the animation, so the ulti still went off. This game is going on for so long, I'm like, holy moly. I'm never gonna get there in time. I've given up. Name your kid Morbius. Can you name me a better cinematic moment than uh, put my pants have sex? I didn't think so. What if we just win here, because they're so deadlocked on getting like mid that we win? If we can somehow delay this, then we I actually unironically might win. Okay, they ended much faster than that. I'm seeing the does he alive? Just go in. <laughs> I mean, I did just Google Chinese kid called Batman and like immediately found Batman been Superman arrested on drug charges. <laughs> That's his uh, passport, Rose. Superman. 